Good morning. And what a delicious day this is. We are going to call you into the power of this now moment. And being in this now moment, the accessibility you have to your field and to your Akashic memory. In this now moment, you have access to your guidance, your inner being, and any other benevolent guide that shows up for you in loving ways. The access to that contact is in the power of the now moment. And this is important because when you come into meditation and find yourself maybe sitting in more worry or doubt, sitting in the future and what's going to happen next, more than being available here in this now moment to what is showing up for you. The balance is off when you are focusing on the things that We cannot be in alignment when you are focusing on the noise of the ice maker. And so the pause is just us allowing you to have some recognition that we can't connect in that energy when your awareness is not on us. So take a moment and go turn off the things that will distract you. And let yourself come back into this now moment and receive our message for today. There's no better time than this present moment for us to be together today. We are acknowledging your willingness in this last couple of weeks to move your channel into places that it has never been. We understand this is stretching you. We understand you are sitting in an uncomfortable place. 
this is the ebb. This is the ebb of integrating the higher aspects of who you are. And we are going to ask that during this mm, neutralization of any past frequencies that do not serve you, you will be able to tune into the feeling or sensation of a void in your energy field because of the release. And we want you to take the reins in programming your consciousness through gratitude and appreciation and awareness of all of the God spaces that you have allowed in already. Walking in flow with your spirit is a very beautiful thing. And while it does require you to hold yourself in a state of accountability, you also are delivered a very beautiful experience. And as a way shower, we are going to ask that you continually ground and stretch so that you really can lead the way. There are hearts watching you that are inspired by your movements, even when they don't verbalize it to you. And this inspiration, this is exactly what we mean by being the light, because you are lighting up this collective. They get ignited in ways that they just don't understand, and the seek for the internal balance the internal connection, harmony, peace begins. So bless the souls that pave the way and bless the hearts that are willing to open even in times where this reality is saying, oh, you should protect yourself. You should hide. They're not like us. Mm. No, they are not. Because you came to exhibit a new way of being that resides in a higher dimensional frequency that many on your planet have never even imagined or thought to perceive before. Hmm. And you knew you'd be wearing your tinfoil hat. And from the other side of the veil, you were fine with this momentary hmm, space that you would fill within the collective. Let your planet change. We don't have many messages for you today. We would rather that you sit in silence and let your vibration rise. We would rather that you sit in gratitude and allow your frequency to soar. Then come into this space. Being in this space right now is amazing. It is everything. It is what we've been calling you towards for years. But now we are calling you towards more. And in the calling you towards more, you are going to have to deepen this connection. And the deepening of the connection that we are now going to ask you to move towards is coming into our energy. Coming into our space.
And you do that when you allow yourself the moments of silence in the morning when you can sit and connect and feel, sense, hear. Everything really is available to you, but we are going to ask that you continue to exercise this mantra of being new. Because only in the being new and allowing in and learning how to continually receive the love of source will you let in the essence of the new earth that you are really asking to project. Because yes, you could stand here and represent this balanced being. Yes, you could stand here and represent this connected being. But you could also stand here and represent the future. You could also stand here in such deepened contact and knowing with us that you activate the collective that's hearing you in ways that you've never, ever amplified them before. There is power and a purity of connection. And once you've learned how to open up that door, you must move through it. You can't just stand there and look at it. And right now, I think a lot of light workers are really experiencing that same energy that you've been feeling, Crystal. You are being called to move through the fear of your power, the fear of the unknown. Not truly the fear of your power, because that's the silliest thing we've ever heard. But the fear of the unknown that could potentially happen as you connect into that space. And we are here to tell you it is nothing more than the absolute most beautiful amplification of exactly where you are right now. It's just you getting better. It's just you being in more alignment. It's you vibrating in more pure fashion. It's them being able to feel that purity vibrating off of you too. And that comes from the connection that we continue to ask you to move into. So while we love that you are coming into this place to channel and connect, the moment you set up your equipment, you started to do it for them. What does the collective need? Hmm. And bless your soul. It has been such a huge part of your opening to direct so much of your awareness on the collective because it pushed you through some very difficult times that you probably would have stalled in. But because you knew you had people who were here to listen, you knew you had to move through certain things and it kept you moving. So at one time, this interaction really did serve you. But we're calling you into more. We want you to serve you and let them receive the byproduct of you giving you all of your time, all of your dedication. You, you had a glimpse of it. And now we are asking you to move permanently into that space. And today was just another moment where we were able to come in and remind you of this new place that we're asking you to step into. Because today you did not do anything wrong. There was nothing wrong with this message. And we actually suggest that you put this out because there are many others that probably need to hear some of that as well so that they can get out of their own way and start to stretch in the way that their guidance is calling them so that they can be the bigger version of them that they've already asked to be expanded into. Just like you. Just like you. You are being called. 
keep going. <clears throat> keep going. You are no longer at a fork in the road. Your path is clear, Crystal. You know the direction that you are heading. And your actions recently have been reflecting that beautifully. Do not be hard on yourself because you needed a break. Do not be hard on yourself because you felt us calling you to spend more time with you. And we can say this for so many on your planet at this time. It will serve you well to allow yourself to spend the majority of your time in your energy in whatever way you need to cultivate that for yourself. Finding ways to kind of bubble yourself in a little bit more so that the sensory growth that you're coming into isn't keeping you focused on others and external energies. As you bubble yourself off, Crystal likes to say, you give yourself the space to build a little bit more of a thick foundation because these times are very intense. And you are shifting so quickly that you may need to bubble yourself off once every other day or so, so that you can continue to fill your energy field with where you're going consciously and allow that to fill that energetic void of the healing so that you can feel yourself moving forward with support and momentum. We will remind you in the ways that we love to remind you. You are right on time. There is nothing missing. There is nothing here for you to figure out. You're just opening your arms and allowing the love of source to reach you. And as you do that, you will be transformed. And as you transform, you light the way by just being you. Document that process. Share it with the people around you. Everything's about to change. And it's going to feel so, so good. We've never loved you more than we do in this moment right now. Receive us. Feel us. Yes. The light is here. Everything's about to change. Keep going. We love you so much. We are complete.